In this Pro Presenter quick tip, we are going to show you how to create a countdown timer that you can use in your productions. First, go to File in the Pro Presenter menu, then go ahead and click New Presentation. Let's call this Five Minute Countdown. Now just make sure your theme is set to default and click New. With Five Minute Countdown selected, let's go to the Edit screen. Now that we are in the Edit screen, we can start designing the countdown to look how we want it to. I'm going to add an ellipse shape, otherwise known as a circle and then fill that with a gradient. Let's make the gradient have some extreme differences in colors so that it pops. All right, let's add the countdown numbers. That's going to need a text box. Now in order for the countdown to actually display the correct numbers, we need to make sure that we link the text box to a five minute timer. I don't have any countdown timers set up yet, so quickly I'll just go to timers in the toolbar. Here we will add a new timer. Make sure it's set to countdown timer. And I want my timer to be five minutes. Then we can exit out of that. Back in the editor, let's go ahead and link to that timer that we just created. I don't want it to show the hours or milliseconds, so I'm going to turn those off. Awesome, let's finish customizing this text. I want the text to be a little more fancy and quite a bit bigger. Great, we'll go back to the show screen now. If I click the countdown, there is no timer going. We need to make sure there is a timer triggered, otherwise the countdown will just show zero. We can add an action to trigger a timer right on the queue itself. What's a queue, you say? Well, it's basically another word for slide. <laughs> you could think of a queue as a collection of actions. We'll right click and add action, choose timer and select the new countdown timer that we made. Now when we fire up the queue, it will start a five minute timer on our output. 